But it's always different when your dive site has lumps in it. It's pretty cool though. Oh. I lost the words. Jim also <laughs> right. some xenotherm stuff. Oh, nice. Send my out of my way, but if it starts to hit the red one. Hello. <gasps> Hello. You have to emphasize the feeling that you come first time to this place and you're kind of like looking wow. around what I'm doing. And actually, two meters down from here, there is a bottom. Mm. It's a sat in the bottom. Yeah. Well, the bottom is quite deep in this one. So you can you can actually put it like that that way to the right, but like not mm -hmm. not horizontally. Mm -hmm. And it, it's okay. There's there is some place where we're gonna have flare in the lens, but that's totally okay. When you come and you can start doing like this, and when you you kind of like start oh, to yeah. measure it like this exactly, and then yeah, something like this. That's great. Thanks, mate. Oh, That's what we're doing. We're, we're planning, we're being patient, we're aiming for perfection. <laughs> and where are you going today? I have absolutely no idea. And then the further you go, you start swimming towards it and it just opens out into this massive, massive opening. It was, it was incredible. And actually seeing it for the first time all lit up by the, the cameras and the lighting crew, it, it was, it was actually like an alien world. You can almost believe Andy was an alien when he was there with the backlit. And also because he's Andy and he's a little bit odd, but that's beside the point. Oyamo and especially Hell's Gate, when I first saw Hell's Gate, it is one of the most incredible things I've seen underwater. It is like diving some old gothic haunted mansion, just so obviously man-made. There was once life there, there was once people worked and lived their lives um, underground mining these areas, and you can see that, and therefore you can kind of, there's a certain sense of the ghosts of the past being present in these big man-made rooms. Oyama Mine has been uh, very popular in uh, dive magazines and video films because it's a quite spectacular looking place and many have been wanting to come here for a dive. But the conditions are absolutely uh, demanding. You have uh, zero degree water on the surface, now we have uh, minus 15, uh, air temperature, so the equipment is uh, going to go under a very hard uh, time in these conditions. Then the water itself, it's cold and deep, so it can reach zero degrees, so it's in no sense a uh, so-called uh, holiday dive. But we need to figure out some really, really simple commands. And I'll be honest, when, when Yanni first came up with the idea, I really didn't understand what he was aiming for. But I think with, with an artist, you kind of just have to trust their vision. And when he said his inspirations were Blade Runner, Space Odyssey, that really is what put it into context for me, what we were trying to achieve here. You are underground, you're a long way from the exit, you are very deep and the water is absolutely freezing. You cannot do deep mixed gas cave diving 
in waters this cold unless you are exceptionally good. These are pretty much some of the hardest conditions you can dive in. Be Hello. careful, Pierre, mate. The scooter broke. Hey, hold on. Listen, I know if you suck eggs, yeah. but when you go, stay close to the wall, please, because I'd hate to see you slide in the water. A little bit to the uh, right. Can you go a little, little bit more, 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 more? That's it. Now directly to the camera. Just behind me? Yeah. And walk to the tanks and start checking out the rebreather. Oh, there's the scooter. But why don't you stand on this side? Yes. Well, I want to have a close-up that we know that, like, what is she taking? Yeah. We need to put put the beast onto the driver, and I think it I needs to be again. quite far away. And when the session is over, young session is over, I'd like to have a, a group picture from all. Yeah, 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 great. yeah, great. Underwater or underwater. Uh, yeah, underwater, yeah, yeah. And yeah. then so then we do the same in, <laughs> in the surface also, but uh, I like to also have an underwater. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. yeah. Definitely. that's good. Yeah, three is like you're doing this, like kind of trying to run upwards, so that yeah. sort of stuff. Yeah. Three throws in a like a what is what is it when you're curving. They walk between the feet and they get. Yeah, yeah. Okay. So three of those. Nice awkwardness that yeah. you had your right hand. Well, it's because you're quite close to me, so I feel yeah. very awkward with you next to me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You kind of you scare me yeah. a little bit. Yeah. Very intriguing. That's game on. I was method acting, right there. Well, you've got to say that. 